is Saul Junction. At the meeting of the Gloucester and Sharpness Canal and the Stridewater Canal. It was a meeting place for ships and crew, boats and boaters from around the world. It was on the route the tall ships take from the River Severn to Gloucester Docks a few miles away. Stridewater Canal was built first, in 1779, linking the Severn to Stroud and allowing coal to be carried to the prosperous textile industry there. It was for a few years the most profitable canal in the country. The Gloucester and Sharpness Canal was the widest and deepest canal in the country when it opened in 1827. Taking seagoing ships, they were able to avoid a dangerous section of the Severn. Gloucester Docks later expanded and Sharpness became a busy commercial dock and shipyard. junction a house was built for the official who collected tolls from vessels travelling from one canal to the other. The Willow Trust is a charity operating passenger boats from Saul Junction which are specially designed to cater for groups of infirm and disabled people who do not have to pay anything as all costs are covered by donations. Volunteers of the Cotswold Canal Trust welcome the public on board their boat, the Endeavour. building to the north of Sandfield Bridge once provided stables for the towing horses and a house for the bridge keeper. The horses were made redundant in 1860, replaced by tugs. The stables became home to a sailmaker, a workshop and repair shop. Eventually, in 2008, it was renovated into a cafe. Here is the Wycliffe Sculling Centre. It houses boats used by the boys of Wycliffe College in Stonehouse. Saul Junction Boatyard in the 19th century was a centre for building and repairing barges and small sailing vessels and the shed was the base for the canal company craftsmen who made and maintained the wooden canal bridges and the lock and dock gates. Nowadays R. W. Davis and Son occupy the whole site including the shed which replaced the old one following a fire. 
The work is now all concerned with building and repairing pleasure craft. Today, the junction is busy with boaters and visitors. Seoul Junction Marina was completed in 2008 and offers a range of services to boaters. A slipway, a boat lifting crane, sale of fuel and toilet facilities. There is a thriving community here. Let's meet a few of the locals. Morning. My name is Chris Harvey. I've been on this waterway now for the, over 50 years. Started off life at Sharpness when I was in the Merchant Navy in 1962. So I remember this canal as it used to be as a working canal. On a day like today, you couldn't wish to be in a better place. My name's Dave Scottford. I come down here, down the canal fishing several times a week. And I find it really enjoyable and it's a lovely spot to come. This is a perch native to the UK and they love canals. They swim around in little packs and they chase little fish and they live on little fish, even their own. They're a bit of a cannibal. But um, they like hiding under boats, weeds and everything else. But they're just beautiful, lovely fish. And the bigger ones have bitten a fin clean off there. He's prey to some of the others that are in here. Mm. So it shows the size of some of the fish that we can get in here, but they're just absolutely beautiful. Bedroom, eventually, for the wardrobe. Bedroom was the dining room. Yeah, uh, that's Hello. Polly, I'm that's Richard. Richard. Um, we've worked on it for a couple of months. We hope to be finished by the end of this month and then we want to move on at the beginning of December and live on it full time. Um, it's a bit bigger than our other one. Our other so, one was 30 feet and this is 48, so it's nice to have more space and more light and more storage, yeah. isn't it? That we can fill out with all the useless junk that you usually accumulate in your house. <laughs>
we're, we're all members of the Gloucester Model Boat Club. My name's Lawrence Wright. My name's Nick Handley. My name is Rob Strong. And I am the Flower Class Corvette. Soul Junction continues to be an important meeting place in our waterways and a vibrant marina community.